really want avocado and poached egg on toast. <laughs> we don't have any avocado. So I think I'm gonna go to the shop. They didn't have avocado. Good morning, Archie. Oh, you need some food. So do I, buddy. So do I. It is Monday morning, by the way. It is so sunny outside. Love it. I'm getting like holiday vibes. Bye bye. Head back. Mm, that's so nice. It was so lovely. We have two eggs, so I can either attempt poached egg or just make scrambled egg. It's a lovely morning though. Let's do some cooking. <laughs> toast or whatever you're eating and you're like do I eat it in two small mouthfuls or one big one it's like I don't want to choke but also I don't know I met Tom Holland a couple weeks ago he's the most famous person I've ever met I wasn't starstruck though I was thinking about this I don't get starstruck really because in my head I can understand that they are just a human being. I was thinking to myself, if I was starstruck by anyone, who would it be? It'd probably be Robert Downey Jr. Because in my head, he's Iron Man. Yeah, like I genuinely think I could meet the Queen and be like, suck me. Oh my God, it's nearly 10 o'clock. Why is it taking me so long? I literally went to the shop at quarter past nine I really want a coffee. We haven't made a coffee together in quite a while, so I think it's time. Although I had coffee yesterday and the day before, and I kind of try to not have coffee like lots of days in a row, because then I get, oh, Baba, oh my God, Archie. I don't know where he was going then. I try not to have coffee like loads of days in a row, because then um, I get addicted, and then if I don't have one one day, just because I don't want one, I get a headache, I like withdrawal headaches, and I'm getting coffee tomorrow, like I know I am, because it's free coffee day. So that's gonna be like four coffees in a row. Anyways, let's make coffee. My aunt has a boiling tap. Why don't I have that? I can't believe I have to waste a minute of my life waiting for the kettle to boil. Oh, I haven't even put the coffee in. <laughs> this is the coffee I'm using. There it is. This is the coffee I'm using. Dunkin' French Vanilla. I never go by these instructions. Just do whatever. Whatever I want. I make a banging coffee these days. Um, when we went to Brighton, I made the girls coffee and it was really good. It's just really good. Tablespoon, I'll do about two. Do I do two or three? I'm gonna do two today. I brew this for four minutes. Oh my god, why am I shaking? All right, four minutes. Starting now. Okay, you don't need to tell me. You don't need to tell me that you're starting the countdown. I'll just believe you. Then I get a separate cup and I'll do two spoons of sugar in. Sometimes I'll use syrup, but if I, like this, this coffee has a French vanilla flavor, so I want to be able to taste it, but I want it to be sweet. So make a little sugar syrup instead of using caramel or, well, I could use vanilla syrup. Oh, I could use vanilla syrup. When my parents are away, sometimes I get really scared that when I am an adult and I live alone, like this is gonna be my life. I, don't, I like this little routine, but if I was doing this all the time, oh my God, I would just cry. Anyways. How nice is this nail colour by the way? Love it. But as long as I have you, I'm happy. Yes. Oh. I just love him so much. How long is left on the timer? There's one second to go. 
Oh, the weather is really nice. Like it is really nice and sunny, but it's, we're getting into autumn now. So the air is very fresh and cold. So my brain is seeing the sun and it's telling me you have to enjoy it. Get as much vitamin D as you can. My body is telling me it's cold, Sinead. You're drinking a nice coffee. Just go sit and watch TV. A little bit conflicted. I'm gonna just pour over the sugar syrup. Oat milk. Perfect. That's absolutely perfect, Sinead. Well done. Sat on the back for yourself there. That is really good. Oh, that is so nice. I really like a coffee in the morning. Yesterday, I went into work. It was raining and I thought, okay, it's time. I'm going to go get a pumpkin spice latte because I have loved pumpkin spice lattes for a while. I'm a big cinnamon fan, I'm not going to lie. Went to good old Starbucks and I said, okay, I had an iced pumpkin spice latte with oat milk. She was like, that's iced, right? And I was like, yes. Then I had to wait quite a while for my coffee. It's fine. They were busy. There was only two of them. The guy puts it down and I was like, oh, I'm so sorry. It was iced. He had given me a hot coffee. First of all, do I look like I drink hot coffee? No, absolutely not. Unless it's a mocha because then that's basically a hot chocolate. I understand. I work in retail, right? I understand that people can have bad days but it's not okay to take it out on others I didn't apologize remade my drink put it down and threw the straw down like with quite a bit of force and i was like i'm sorry you had to remake my drink but like i, w I wasn't gonna drink that i'm not gonna waste five pounds drinking something i'm not gonna like i drank my pumpkin spice latte and i thought i don't like this I can't believe I'm saying this. I don't like pumpkin spice latte anymore. I'll try it. I'll try a frappuccino and I'll try hot. But I, th I think the time has come. I think I've finally come to the realization that Starbucks is a bit of a rip off. I do quite like Starbucks coffee. I'll get it every so often to treat myself, but it's, I have to say it's no longer my go-to. My go-to is Costa. I'm a Costa girl. Their reward system is great. So is Cafe Nero as well, actually. Anyways, lovely day. Really lovely. I love blue skies. There's nothing makes me smile more in the morning than when I open my curtains and see a blue sky. 